I now present to you the recipient of the 2014 Jerry Cole Sportsmanship Award, Cooper Dossie. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, hi, my name is Cooper Dossie. Most of you know that I battle a stutter, so please feel free to laugh when it happens. I want to start by thanking Mr. Hamblin and the entire AJGA staff for honoring me with this award. You have blessed all of us that play AJGA with incredible opportunities, and we are so grateful. In fact, I think the AJGA should be renamed the Living the Dream Tour. Think about it. We get to play TBC Sawgrass, Old Sandwich, Sedgefield Country Club, and PJ National, just to name a few. Not only do we get to play these, these venues, but we're often treated like tour pros. I would also like to thank my family, my dad, my mom, and my brothers Luke and Sam, as well as my grandparents. You've all made great sacrifices to allow me to chase the, the dream God has given me. James 1.17 says, Every good and perfect gift is from above, coming down from the Father of the heavenly lights, who does not change like shifting shadows. God has given me so many gifts through the game of golf, and, and tonight I would like to share three of those with you. The gift of a friendship, a strength in faith, and the hope for a future. To say that God has given me friends through golf that stick closer than a brother could not be truer. I could never have dreamed that the, that the boys I played against and looked up to at age 10, Philip Barbary, Nathan Johnson, Sam Burns, and Brad Dockey, would one day be my teammates at the Wyndham Cup, my FaceTime buddies over the summer, and the friends that truly are like brothers to me. Every single one of these guys is also d d deserving of this award. Thank you for spurring me on and continuing, and con and continuing to be role models for what true sportsmanship looks like. Another gift God gave me time and time again over the last two years was the opportunity to strengthen my faith. We have chosen a hard game. We have chosen a gentleman's game. It is often hard to behave like a gentleman when you ram a 20 footer 10 feet past the hole at Carson Creek. <laughs> but seriously, y'all need to know that the summer of 2013 was one of my hardest seasons as a golfer. I had three weeks in a row where I struggled to break 80 and either missed a cut or finished towards the bottom. My parents and my grandparents have always taught me that golf is what I do, but it is not who I am. My identity has to be grounded in Jesus Christ and struggling on the golf course taught, and struggling on the golf course taught me that I'm not my bad scores, but I'm not my good scores either. That struggle also taught me a lot about sportsmanship. Being a good sport means encouraging others even when you don't feel encouraged. I am thankful for that summer long struggle because I learned that how I carry myself and how I honor God matters more than my results. F finally, God has given me the, the hope of a future and the chance to play Division I golf at Texas A&M. He has blessed me with an opportunity for, for a great education, awesome teammates and coaches, and the chance to be involved with College Golf f f Fellowship. As a Leadership Links participant, I chose CGF because it is a ministry that is aimed at college golfers and is all about growing closer to Christ through discipleship. Leadership Links has taught me the importance of giving back so that others, too, may have the hope of a future. It humbles me to know that I share this award with my friends and past winners, Toba Niblett and Thomas Walsh. Both of these guys raised thousands of, of um, dollars f for charity. <laughs> through leadership links and modeled for me the spirit of giving. In closing, I'm so honored to receive the Jerry Cole Sportsmanship Award. My hope is that if you see anything good in me, you would know that it's not me. It is Jesus Christ inside of me. In the words of the uh, Apostle Paul, not that I've already obtained all this or I've already arrived at my goal, but I press on to take hold of that for which Christ took hold of me. Brothers and sisters, I do not consider myself yet to have taken hold of it. But one thing I do, forgetting what is behind and straying towards what is ahead, I press on towards the goal to win the prize for which God has called me heavenward in Christ Jesus. Thank you. <laughs>